Hey everyone, this is Honda Nguyen. How's everyone all doing today? All right guys, today I'm gonna show you guys how to transfer your old data from your old phone, okay, to your brand new phone or your brand new iPhone. All right, so today we're gonna be doing a uh, transfer from our iPhone 11, uh, this one right here, the iPhone 11 Pro Max to the iPhone 12 Pro Max. This is the one that uh, we just, um, Got it in the mail, okay? Uh, just arrived, the iPhone 12 Pro Max just arrived, uh, basically just came out today. So um, yeah, so let's go ahead and do it. All right, so if you guys, basically what you guys wanna do is turn on the um, the new iPhone, which is this one, and then you're gonna see this. Go ahead and just tap in hello. And then once you, once you tap in that, it's gonna ask you on the left side, your old phone, um, if you would like to um, continue setting up your new iPhone, we're going to go ahead and do that. And then once you do that, it's going to have that little um, earth sign or whatever moving around. You want to use this phone and hold your, your new iPhone up to the camera so you can scan that, okay? There we go. Okay, so that there we go, we got that in. And so now, sorry about that little blurriness right there, but uh, now it says, keep this iPhone near your new iPhone while your information is transfer. And then on the new one, it says, um, put in your um, new, uh, basically your password from the other um, iPhone, okay? So we'll go ahead and do that real quick. All right, so I already did that. Now it's gonna say it may take a few minutes to activate your phone. So let's give it some time. All right, so we're actually doing this wirelessly uh, with Wi-Fi, okay? You wanna to connect to Wi-Fi? Cause you know, there's times where you don't have, you know, you can do it via a wire, you know, but you know, that's just too much. Um, you gotta buy more wires. Sometimes, you know, you just want to do it uh, wirelessly out and about. So this is a good way to do it. So right now we are just waiting. It says, like I said, it says it may take a few minutes to activate your phone. So just give it a few minutes. It will take a while. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video and it will come back when it's done. Okay. All right, actually, you know what? <laughs> I was gonna turn off the the, uh, the thing, but uh, now it says Face ID. You know, we're gonna go ahead and set that up later. You can do it right now if you want, but we're gonna go ahead and do that later, okay? So I'm gonna go set up later. And then right now it's gonna say transfer your data. You can directly transfer your data during setup or finish downloading it later. So we got two options here, transfer from iPhone, uh, transfer directly. So this iPhone will be ready with your data when you first finish setting up. It will take about 10 to 15 minutes or you can download from iCloud, okay? We're gonna go ahead and do this, the first one, trans transfer from iPhone. So let's go ahead and tap on that. And then it's just gonna ask you, we're just gonna have to set up the Apple ID so that way it, you know, it knows uh, it's your, basically your Apple ID and your phone. Go ahead and um, agree to the terms and condition. So just go ahead and watch what it's doing. Okay, guys. So at least when you guys are doing it yourself, you guys know how to do it because I don't wanna be skipping around and it's gonna make it harder for you guys. So, you know, it's best to just um, do it step by step. All right, so I say settings from your other iPhone. The following settings can be transferred from uh, your old iPhone 11 Pro Max or you can customize them individually, okay? So what we're gonna do is, um, we're gonna go ahead and just press continue. So we have everything from the old phone to the new phone. Keep your iPhone up to date, press continue.
and then like i said it's going to take some time so just watch it um for the apple pay we're going to go ahead and do it later on bottom here just go set up later in wallet and then we also we do have an apple watch um that is linked to the iphone 11 pro max so we, we will go ahead and do continue just in case if you guys don't have a uh, apple watch then you guys go ahead and just press set up later but for in this purpose we're going to set up the apple watch as well okay so go ahead and press continue siri um let's just go ahead and do it later so we'll set it up later share with uh developers or don't share normally i just put don't share up to you guys okay all right, so now it says transferring data from iPhone 11 Pro Max. Keep your other iPhone nearby and connect it to power until the transfer is complete, okay? So it's it's gonna tell you, it's gonna give you like an estimate of how long it's gonna take. Now it's actually going up. It was like one minute, now it's like at uh, four minutes now. So what I'm gonna do, this part is where it's actually gonna take a while. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause the video and we'll be right back when it's done, okay? All right, so we are back here. It took actually only about uh, five minutes, guys. I guess because uh, we don't have too much data, you know? Uh, it could depend on uh, each individual's phone, all right? But it took only five minutes for the transfer to complete. And it will say, transfer complete your data has been transferred to your other iphone and then it's going to say you all that stuff right there before you trade in give away or sell this iphone you should completely erase it by going to settings and choosing erase all content and settings all right so that the old phone is done now we're just waiting for the new phone to load up go ahead and tap on continue on the old phone and then we should go back into the front screen of the old iPhone and we will uh, wait for the new one to power up. Okay, it's loading right now as you guys can see. All right, so I'm gonna pause the video again here because it may take a while for, uh... oh, you know what, actually it's up already. It's actually came up pretty quickly. Um, so now let's go ahead and play around with the new phone and see if everything actually went over. Let me put in the password real quick. All right, so now it says restore complete. Apps and data will continue downloading in the background. Go ahead and press continue. We're gonna go ahead and agree to the terms and condition. Go ahead and agree it again. Restore complete. Okay, so now go ahead and press continue or already continue by itself. And then, like I said, Apple Pay will probably do it later. Go ahead and press uh, set up later. Improve Siri and dictation. I'm gonna not gonna do it right now. We'll do it later. And then we're not gonna share it again. Go ahead and press continue. Display Zoom. And then welcome to iPhone. Let's see if everything comes over. Okay, guys. Okay. Use this iPhone when sharing your location. Go ahead and press use. And then there you go, guys. Uh, everything now is getting downloaded uh, into the brand new phone, okay? So it looks like everything is getting loaded over. So as you can see, um, as you can see, the, the background picture is there. Looks like um, everything looks like it's gonna be there. All the the apps is loading up, okay? Same goes with this side. And then same goes with the setting on itself right there. So uh, that's it, guys. That is how you um, transfer your data from your old iPhone to your new iPhone. All right, guys, if you guys have any questions or comment, leave them down below. Uh, if you guys haven't uh, subscribed to my channel yet, make sure to hit that subscribe button, okay? And tap on the notification bell. So whenever I upload any new videos, you know, you'll be the first to be notified. All right, guys, I hope this tutorial here helps you guys out. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.